Hi guys, it's your boy Kakarot here, fresh off the second playthrough of Resident Evil 2. And wow, wow, what a remake of a game that is. And I'm enjoying it so, so much. Which got me kind of thinking, what other games or franchises could get the remake treatment? My first thought was, well, pretty much everybody's first thought was probably Silent Hills or Silent Hill. But let's be honest, we all know Konami doesn't make fucking video games anymore, do they? No. So that got me thinking, and I was thinking and thinking and thinking, and I stopped on Dead Space. Dead Space needs to come back. This is the right time for it now. The success of Resident Evil 2, and it's pr I think it's all pretty much guaranteed that Capcom's going to make a remake of Resident Evil 3. I mean, it's it's been critical and fan reception has been amazing for this game. Not only that, but the graphics are absolutely immense and it's ju it just lives up to the original in, in every single way. It's a genre of its own. And I think that fits Dead Space brilliantly because the way they've transitioned Resident Evil to over the shoulder, Dead Space was already over the shoulder. Or maybe you could do something new. Maybe you could turn it first person. It showed on the Wii that you can do a first person Dead Space game. Although with the horror in it. And that maybe they should keep it third person. But there's so much in that universe still left to be told. There's so many things. It doesn't even have to be the necromorphs anymore. It could be a completely new threat of alien hybrid species or something that could be mixed together. There's so much. Like horror in space is. There's so many routes you could go. But Dead Space, uh, Dead Space is, again, critically acclaimed. The first game was amazing. The second game was fantastic. Okay, the third game, they went the co-op action-y routes as the series went on. Uh, it wasn't the best. It wasn't, it wasn't bad, but it, I don't think it was what people wanted and what people were going for. Uh, again, with EA with their live service slapping their microtransactions in there pretty much killed the franchise but this is they've had a break now i mean resident evil has been on the same route resident evil had it was mixed reception for five um i think six was critically panned by critics and some fans didn't like it even resident evil 7 which i personally love some people didn't like the first person route and the action with the fact that there was no zombies for that as well and then they've gone back, obviously, with the remakes, which has been absolutely amazing. Capcom are on a bit of a roll right now. And I just, I'm just i just looking at EA, which is probably the major problem, EA. And I'm looking at this and thinking, jump on this cash cow, man. It's it's there to be taken. A, a single player, eight, hour, eight to ten hour campaign of Dead Space, pure horror on an abandoned spaceship or, or, what, or whatever. It's the right time. It's the right time to bring Dead Space back. Now, give it to the hands of the developers that could do an absolutely cracking job of it. Don't rush it. Don't slap your microtransactions on it. And got a recipe for success there. And I think EA have been suffering with their single player games. And this, I think, making a Dead Space game now, EA, if you're listening, is a great way to win some back some people here. Dead, well, yeah, Dead Space and a Knights of the Old Republic game. Those are the those are your two must haves at the minute. Like I said, guys, tell me tell me what you think. Whether or not you'd love to see another Dead Space game, so leave them in the comments below. Because I just think there's something there. I I honestly believe that this is the best time. You look at all the single player games right now, whether it be God of War, Last of Us, Resident Evil remake, Horizon Zero Dawn. I mean, the list is endless, but single-player games are not dead, yay. They are not dead. And it's been, throughout 2018, even looking at 2019, even Xbox, with the acquisition of all their studios, are really pushing for the single-player orientated games. The market's there. The market is there for Dead Space to kick ass. EA have got the money. They've got the resources to make this happen. It's a case of whether or not they think it's profitable enough. I can see this going as, like I said, two ways. I think, yes, I think if you make the game everybody wants to see, pure horror, claustrophobic, gory horror, it's going to be an 18. It might cut a few people off, but I think with the horror at the minute, especially with streamers and Twitch and stuff like that, that it's got a bigger market than it ever has before. And for the success, success of Resident Evil, they must be looking at this thinking, can we, can we? And I think it's now. It's now or never. EA. Capitalise on Capcom's success 
with Resident Evil. Try to squeeze it in there. Make that space happen. That's all. If you like this video, guys, please leave a like and subscribe. It helps me out a lot. And join the Saiyan Army. Stay frosty, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.